Walk down the street and you will probably spot finger-sized colorful plastic tubes discarded on the ground. We are talking about disposable vapes, which are considered easy to use and cheaper alternatives to cigarettes. However, the activists have called them an environmental nightmare. Market is flooded by unsafe vapes aimed at children. They are booming in popularity, especially among those aged between 18 and 34. Disposable vapes, which last for around 600 puffs, contain valuable materials such as lithium batteries and copper. They also contain plastic and are classified as waste, electrical and electronic equipment. The number of people using e-cigarettes has doubled between the year 2016 and 2019. According to the federal government, with a survey showing more than 30% of 14 to 17-year-olds have tried vaping. Environment groups have called for urgent clarity and regulation to respond to an increase in hazardous waste from e-cigarettes as vaping becomes more popular. Now, the head of Clean Up Australia says that the sharp increase presented a new and serious environmental issue, with volunteers discovering littered e-cigarettes in increasing volumes. Moreover, the founder of advocacy group No More Bats says that he was aware of schools that have now got buckets of confiscated vaping devices and are unclear what to do with them. Some local councils accept vapes in their e-waste collections, but many don't do that due to the concerns about potential leaching of battery acid, lithium and nicotine. The devices have also been linked to explosions and fires. Now, many product stewardship schemes do not accept e-cigarettes or can only process the battery. But many disposable vapes often have an encapsulated battery that cannot be removed. Now, according to the New South Wales Environmental Protection Authority, many vaping stores do provide basic information on how to discard of products, but this is of limited use as regulations vary widely across the state. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.